Hello everyone. Now today what I thought I might show you is um, a Corgi East Lanks Viking um, bus model uh, in the Delane Buses livery. Um, I recently brought this because um, um, I recently brought this because I, um, I was I was planning on sal salvaging the left wing mirror to put onto my my road car East Lanks Viking. Because at one point when I was playing with this bus um, like a kid, I lost the left wing mirror and I couldn't find it anywhere. And that's the main reason why I brought another East Lanks Viking, because um, I did plan on buying another one of these, but um, by the time I did, they were all sold on eBay, which disappointed me. So I had to buy another wing mirror that was compatible. But I'm, I'm planning on selling this afterwards anyway. So I thought I might as well do a video of this um, for my YouTube channel, just to show you what... Um, this bus is like and um, I'm just going to take this out of the box and um, let me just put this on the um, on the blue tack just to mount the camera there we go and as you can see there's a perspex screen there's a plastic top on there and I love its um, I love its um, two-tone blue livery with um, blue stripe. Now, Delane Buses is um, it's the longest-serving independent bus operator in Lincolnshire, and they run a small number of bus routes. They run a, they, although they do run a, a small number of bus routes across South Lincolnshire, as well as in the Peterborough area of Cambridgeshire. They um, they are a very well-known bus company in South Lincolnshire, hence why they've got a model. And um, as you can see, it's um, there's a route branding on here. Um, you've got the route branding on that sh that um, shows the one hundred one and one hundred two between um, between um, Morton, Bourne, the Deepings, and Peterborough. And I think it's two hundred one and two hundred two for the route between Stamford and Peterborough. Um, as you can see, it says it's on the one hundred one to Bourne now. The one one that runs between Bourne and Peterborough, that's the only route that runs seven days a week. Um, all the rest of the routes only either run Monday to Friday or Monday to Saturday, like the two hundred one and two hundred two between between Stamford and Peterborough. Um, I I did ride with Delane buses once um, from Spalding up to Market Deeping when I was when I was going to an antique shop in Market Deeping, and. Um, at the time, they only had weekday bus services, but um, since then, they've got a limited number of Saturday bus services. But, um, but yeah, the flagship route is the 101 between Bourne and Peterborough, because um, Delane buses are based in Bourne. And as you can see, there's red seating inside of this bus, um, because they've got like a, um, I think it's got like a red tartan um, seating design on their seats. And it's a bit strange for this East Lanks Viking because, um, as you can see, it's a four-door opening, a four-door fold opening, which you normally only see on step entrance buses, like the Leland buses. Um, I mean, this, this East Lanks Viking bus model is low floor. Um, which, of course, uh, makes it easier for them. Um, Prams and pushchairs to access the bus as well as wheelchair users. And that's the other side of the bus model. And the rear is a little bit different to my road car East Lanks Viking. Um, mainly because it's got um a bottom um, a bottom back windscreen. Um, um I'll just put the tube aside for comparison. And but they do both have a retract um an opening bonnet panel. Um, I'll just open this. Oh, I'm just open the panel there. Um, so as you, as you can see, so as you can see, that's the engine in the road car East Lanks Viking. Um, there is one here as well. Um, 
but the plastic base is in the way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to unscrew the bus off its base so I can show you it because um, there was one YouTube user who did a video of this um, several years ago, but um, he didn't have the screwdrivers to unscrew the, um, unscrew the bus off the base. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause this video and show you, um, and then I can show you um, the engine inside the, um, inside the bonnet. Right. Well, as you can see, I've just un unscrewed, um, unscrewed the bus off of its base. So I can show you the rear um, in more detail. So that's the bonnet itself. Oh, it is loosely opening. Um, I'm just going to um, try and see if I can... There we go. Oh, it just, I'm just about to just close it again. See if I can keep this propped open. I think this one's much looser than my Road Car East Lanks Viking in terms of prop keeping it open. There we go. And as you can see, there's the engine inside the opening bonnet panel. It's quite different um, compared to my other road um, compared to my other East Lanks Viking that I've got because um, well not the design of the engine itself I think um, I'll see if I can oh, it's, it's, looks like it's going to stay closed but I don't know if the en engine design looks different. No, I think it's got the same tooling with the engine design. But I think the I think the bonnet panel on, on this Delane bus is much looser um, than what it is on my Rose Car East Lanks Viking. And um as you can see on the back of this bus, um you've got the Delane logo there, you've got the route number on the back, the 101 that runs between Bourne and Peterborough. And I think this is their top two routes, well, their main two routes, um, the 101 and 102 that runs between um, Warren and Peterborough. I think the Morton's on the 102, I think. And then you've got the 202, well, the, 201, the 201 and 202 that runs between Stamford and Peterborough. That one only runs Monday to Saturday, that one does, the route between Stamford and Peterborough, but the other one... That runs between um, Warren and Peterborough. That runs seven days a week. Well, on the one hundred and one, that is um, one hundred and two, which I think is the one that runs up to up to Morton. I think that's only runs Monday to Saturday. And you, as you can see, you got the got the, um, the golden Delane logo there at the back. Let's see if I can get the camera to focus. Oh, it's about to turn the light on. There you go. And um, as you can see, it's got the Volvo logo on the back and the um, ELC on, on the back there. Come on, camera, please focus. If I do it back a little bit. There we go. ELC, that stands for East Lancashire Coach Builders. And it's got the, um, the, um, the type of bus that it is, which is the Viking. And as you can see on the back, it's got like a um, it's got about a bottom back um, windscreen window, but um, but Rose Cars um, East Lanks Viking doesn't. I suppose it was because it was due to the position of the, the route number and probably to make way for the um the map on the back. But they both have the um the rear fire exit window, which was probably a legal requirement for them to have um. um a fire exit window on the back in case of um, an emergency. And I'll just show you it in fine detail again. Again, you've got the number plate on there, Volvo logo and, and the um, ELC logo on there. This was manufactured back in two thousand and four. Um, this um, 
Delane buses East Lax Viking. And a year later, um, they did the road car East Lax Viking, as you can see here. And I do plan on salvaging its um, left wing mirror from this bus to um, put on my road car um, bus model because I it's because I'm more interested in road car than any other bus company. And I did ride with delay buses once um, before back. Um, I think it was back in 2021 because I went on there. I think it was their 301 or 302. Um, from Spalding to Market Deeping, even though the route runs all the way down to Stamford, but I only went as far as Market Deeping on it because um because I was mainly going to to an antique shop in in Market Deeping. It, I think it, I know about what I know about the routes between Spalding and Stamford. I think it's three hundred one and three hundred two. It did originally only run on weekdays, but I think Delane have now got a limited number of Saturday buses on it, which is good. Um, but it's still very limited in number. All the rest of the routes, I believe, are just um, school routes that only run Monday to Friday during school days. I think one of the routes that I've seen runs on Thursdays, just on them, um, just on a Tuesday, I think it is, or or a Thursday. I don't know. Um, oh yeah, there was a Tuesday only bus service on one of their routes um, from Spalding to I can't remember where it is. But anyway, um, what I've got here as well is the um, collector card to say that this bus is um, to certify that this model is a limited edition and is number 781 of only 2,400 dis distributed worldwide. So that's the East Lakes Viking um, in Delane Buses livery. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this out of the packet so I can show you the back of it. Right, I've just got the card out, out of the pack. As you can see, there's the um, there's a little pamphlet there that shows, I think, the other bus models. But this is the card. Oh, stop this the tape. There we go. It's quite a long, um, quite a long description here. It says here, the origins of Delane buses of Bourne, Lincolnshire can be traced back to 1890 when the family introduced horse-drawn vehicles to cater for local people wishing to travel to markets throughout the surrounding area. The first motor bus introduced in 1919, well, was introduced in 1919, and daily services from Bourne to Peterborough, Stamford, Spalding, Sleaford and Grantham were all established by 1923. Now, now run by the fifth generation of the Delane Smith family, the core business is still based around some of the those original services, which have been developed and tailored using a careful blend of tradition and acting on current market demands. Aptly, a D O three oct was the um well o o c t is the third Volvo B seven T L with an East Lanx Viking body to enter the fleet in March two thousand three, and was the first. To and was the first to carry the new format re registration plate. Finished in house style, which blends all modern requirements with traditional delaying features, including the exterior livery, which has remained unchanged since the introduction of double-deckers in 1948, and wood veneer interior with red tartan seating edged with maroon edging and piping. Well... I didn't know that Delane buses ran as far as Sleaford. And I didn't know that Delane buses ran as far as Sleaford and Grantham. But I haven't seen them I haven't seen those on any of their route numbers now. I think the ones in Sleaford and Grantham have been taken over by Centre Bus. But they still they've still got a number of bus routes within Spalding, Peterborough and Bourne and Stamford. So yeah, it's um much longer description that I've got on here than what I have got than what I had on my um, road car bus models. Well, I'm gonna end this video now. And if you've liked my video, give it a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all later. Bye for now.